Little Monsters is still a fun, entertaining, cute, goofy, horror slash zombie comedy film. It, it still is upon rewatching. So we have Crazy Lady from Us, Don't Remember Her Name, and Creepy Uncle David. I think that's his name. I'm gonna call him Creepy David, right? Where he like, you know, he teaches his, his young nephew to kindergarten school. He like immediately has a crush and falls in love with the, the teacher. And you know, he like takes a picture of her and... Or takes like a photo from her class and starts jacking off to it. Like every guy should do or whatever. And I was like, okay, sure. There are some comedy here where for me it, it didn't hit. Where I should have laughed but I didn't laugh. But that doesn't take away from this movie. It's still like good. So obviously a zombie apocalypse happens. Because they're going trying to go on this field trip to like a farm. And a zombie apocalypse happens. And I love the fact that Uncle David or Creepy David and this teacher are keeping their cool. And so this field trip turns into like a, like a zoo sort of show and tell into a full-on real-life zombie apocalypse field trip i love that i love that twist and spin on it so obviously she's trying to keep cool she's singing shake it off by taylor swift throughout the whole movie they just like singing it for some reason whoever is the director or writer for this they love taylor swift it's just immediate love for taylor swift but anyways you know they go around they touch each other's shoulders acting like little kids these kids are not only cute also just like oblivious <laughs> to the zombies around them trying to eat them so they're trying to keep their cool they're like singing they're like walking around like nothing's happening the zombies in those movies are are slow Slow. They're like season one Walking Dead zombies where they're just, you know, they're kind of slow. They don't run on you like World War Z or like Train of Busan zombies. But yeah, they eventually get to this little house where this fucking fat guy is super selfish and doesn't want any of them to come inside him. He doesn't want to be eaten. And so they eventually get inside. Oh yeah, this, <laughs> this is fun. It's cute. There's one funny bit where uh, this kid likes being Dark Vader, Star Wars. There's this is one scene where like, you know, he's pulling out all his hand and closing the gate even though it's just a zombie coming towards him and closing the gate. I was a fun scene where he thinks he has his dark vader powers and he like holds out his hand and you know surprisingly the gate closes he's like and he he goes back i love that kid that kid was fun and cute but it feels like for a long time they're in this in this building which is good and bad they do you know things and stuff but it does feel like they're in there for a bit of time kind of breaks down a bit honestly but they obviously have to get out they help save fat guy even though he should die in the end he like not only turns to a zombie bites a kid like fucking zombie off like one of the ears off but he like betrays them again so you know fuck that guy he's awful he's mean and then i feel like eventually uncle david and creepy uncle david and teacher they you know they take a they take a liking to each other i don't think they kiss or anything but there is a you know interest in one another and so like, obviously while this is happening there's shots of armies trying to kill every zombie u.s armies involved blah 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 again the kids they have to go out somewhere right so they're on the back of the truck i think you know they're singing trying to keep the kid calm that all of the kids calm and they all stay calm i was expecting one of the kids to start crying i don't think happened maybe he did but i just was having so much fun i forgot but i think none of the kids started crying and acting like little bitches which is what kids should be doing at their age right four or five years old but they didn't which is good so they eventually uh, again the army catch up to them there's like the shooting like you know these zombies in slow motion all guts are falling off that was cool to see they do need all these people to be staying in quarantine right now like i am in california i'm in quarantine which is very appropriate for this movie so yeah they have to stay in this quarantine they're in this like not glass thing but they're quarantine wearing all white all the children they're singing taylor swift shake it off and that's how this you know the movie ends so yeah movie was a lot of fun it was really cute seeing all these kids just staying like being not only oblivious staying pure and like just positive throughout the whole movie i was like okay this is different this is a lot of fun a cool little spin and twist and with that i had a fun time watching this movie i thought it was a blast next movie the 19th will be a movie called mom and dad starring nicholas cage and this other lady home i'm forgetting here was nicholas cage so hopefully it's good